hello everyone and welcome once again welcome to my channel and today i want to show you guys how to literally produce a laundry bar soap but this time around with an extra ingredient called stpp in full it's actually called sodium triphosphate or sodium tripolyphosphate those are the names for stpp so this chemical um is actually a filler it it it, uh, it plays two roles in soap making it plays as a filler in terms of making your soap look bigger and also it also plays like a water softener implying that it makes hard water soft so this is a formula on how to get the quantity of stpp to use when making your soap so when you whenever you're making your soap just use that formula displayed on the screen with that with that formula you will know the quantity of stpp to use in each um, bar soap you want to make so you you add your oil and your caustic soda then multiply it by 15 percent the answer you get is the quantity of stpp you should use in making that particular laundry bar soap so in this video i'll be showing you how to use it how to dissolve it and how to use it alongside with your caustic soda so you just watch this video and understand then also this video also shows you how to know the quantity of stpp to use so you don't end up adding too much of stpp you know in life too much of anything is a problem so everything has a particular measurement you should use so that you won't end up producing something that is bad so in this video i want to show you what stpp is used for so that you understand it properly stpp is a filler in soap making it makes your soap a little bit bigger in size or in quantity then also it plays another role of making hard water soft when hard water is soft your soap leathers properly if you use a soap in soft water, it leathers properly. But if you use a soap in hard water, it struggles to leather. But once you have an extra ingredient like STPP in your soap production, it makes the hard water to be soft by breaking down some particular mo molecules that prevent the leathering or the foaming of soap. Another chemical that plays similar role with the softening of hard water is the sodium silicate but sodium silicate doesn't really act like a filler but it um, helps hard water to be soft so if you want something that will play the two roles of softening hard water and also coming in as a filler in terms of making your soap a little bit um, bigger or larger in quantity that in stpp is the best thing to go for so you can see how I dissolved my caustic soda. First of all, I dissolved my STPP first. After dissolving my STPP and I make sure that it was completely dissolved, I now let added my caustic soda. It's as simple as that. Dissolve your STP, STPP first, which is called sodium triphosphate or sodium tripolyphosphate. When you go to the chemical shop, just tell them you need STPP. They will sell it to you it's a very popular chemical then after you've dissolved your stpp you now pour in your caustic soda but make sure your stpp has been properly dissolved now you can see i have kept that my caustic soda and stpp to cool down because whenever water is added to caustic soda or whenever caustic soda is dissolved in anything that has water it heats up it becomes very hot so i've kept it kept it aside for it to cool down now for the time for it to cool down it varies it usually um, takes some minutes some hours for it to cool down so you just wait for it to cool down once it cools down use it to make your soap so mine has cooled down i've poured it into my oil there it's as simple as that then also don't forget that i run online classes on whatsapp you check the description of this video you will see a link you click on the link it will take you to whatsapp where you can join my online classes there you learn a lot of things you learn how to make the laundry bar soap the organic soap the body cream the powder detergents 
the Vaseline, shampoo, liquid soap. There's a lot of things you learn there. The organic soap, the whitening soap. You learn a lot of things from my online classes. Very soon, I'm bringing in the tra- how to make the transparent soap. For those I want to learn how to make transparent soap, I'll be teaching it also at my online classes. Then also my ebook, specially written by me, my own ebook is now available for sale. Check the description of this video. You will see a website where you can click on and purchase the ebook online. You just purchase it and download it. It's not expensive it's very affordable my online class is also affordable so don't forget to check the description for the link where you can join the online class and also there is a link at the description where you can purchase my ebook it's very explanatory and very down to earth there you will learn how to produce a lot of skin care like the soap the body cream the detergent so many things you learn from my ebook just in case you don't have time to enroll for the class, you can use the ebook to learn.
okay so thanks for watching this video don't forget to like to share to subscribe to the channel so that you can be updated by our new and latest videos that will be coming within the week and also don't forget to check the description of this video for the link where you can join my online classes on soap making and other skincare production and also don't also forget to purchase the ebook this ebook is actually very rich it has a lot of rich content and is very self-explanatory it will help you produce skincare at your comfort zone help you produce skincare the likes of the soap the laundry bar soap the bathing soap the body cream the liquid soap the shampoo the hair conditioner the vaseline it helps you produce this in at your comfort zone the ebook just in case you're not be having time to join the online class you can use the ebook to learn at home it has step-by-step -step procedures and formulas so my online class is available for those that want to learn and the ebook is available too for purchase goodbye and see you next time on our next video don't forget to like to share this video and also to subscribe to the channel bye